right, so here he is with much fanfare, the number one lightweight contender challenging for UFC gold here tonight. Hay is in the barn. He feels like he has put in all the requisite work to realize the dream. He's been working so hard. When you watch the video, you can see a guy that will not accept anything less than being super prepared for the biggest opportunity of his career. He has worked diligently. He has trained hard. He has brought in training partners. He's done everything. Now it's all about going out there and executing. He said he feels he's ready to do that and become the UFC champion. But it must be stated in this division with all of the contenders, oftentimes you only get one crack. Let's see what he can do. See, in a video game setting, this dude's got to be pretty fun to play with. Yes, he does have a lot of varied striking techniques and things that are very good to see on television. So as your front match, Mark Casey's doing jumping double kicks, so he would be a fun guy, but ultimately, you don't get those skills in the video game unless you possess them in right. real life, and Jacasey possesses those striking techniques that allow him to be as exciting as you see him on your television screen right now. Took some of the pressure off with a recent win over Joseph Duffy, Mark Jacasey, back looking for another win here tonight. Well, so much UFC history has played out here at T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. Plenty more where that came from tonight. The athletes are ready to go. All right, Herb Dean, third man in the octagon for this one. Good to have you with us tonight from T-Mobile Arena, the home of the NHL's Vegas Golden Knights, and the building in which DC shot some of the MMA world at UFC 226, uh, but this venue will always have a special place for you. This venue holds a special place in my heart. UFC 226, I became the double champion. This is a fight venue that you should want to compete in. A great arena where you can make history. Tonight, you get your chance. Jacasey gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Time kick to the body for the champion. Leg kick is true. Jacasey gets absolutely melted by that head kick. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Oh, the high kick lands. Oh, and the Superman punch is good. He is going after that overhand right. Big elbow there, Lance. Ooh, pretty good uppercut. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Jacasey. Oh, really good with the kick to the body. <laughs> Just over three minutes now to go in round one. Jacasey's overhand punch to the head doesn't get there, blocked by the defense. Just misses there with the left. Wow! Spinning back fist. That was a nice strike. Right. Well, he's looking for that left hand, just out of range, though, with it. Right hook to the head block. Slips that left hand. Circling to his right. Left hand finds the target. him with the straight. Nice job there by Jacasey. 
Oh. Nice shot there by Champ. Champ, look at that redness underneath his elbow. A lot of those strikes to the body starting to pile up. Getting beat up and being smart enough to not be headhunting the entire time. I like this. I like this approach. Let's get some points. Under two minutes now to go round one. Oh, effective <laughs> use of the jab by Jacaso. <laughs> Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Wow. Ooh, nice uppercut from the champ. Oh, brilliant execution to land the roundhouse. Missed with that right hand. Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proving prophetic right there. I mean, his vision and his timing allows him to get that technique up. Just out of range with the big right hand. Nice straight right lance. Unable to connect with a right hook. Great block there. 30 seconds to go now. Way to hide that leg. Oh, and so now he lands another combination, so it's never just one shot. There's always two or three coming behind. A lot of times people throw singular strikes. Not this, gentlemen. This man is triggering four or five, six in a row. What a great job. All right, so what a round it was for him, particularly when it comes to those body kicks, DC. Landed those body kicks every single time he threw them. Every time he decided body kick is going to be the strike, it landed. His opponent needs to do something different, or this fight is not going to last much longer. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, second round underway. All right, so the next round is underway. Will it be more of the same? And by that, I mean all of those strikes to the body. You got to think at some point the opposition is going to lower that guard or get finished. And that's exactly what he is hoping for. All those great body shots, all that damage he's put on his opponent will force an opening up top where he will look to finish. Well, new round, same result as he continues to punish the body yet again, just as he did in the previous round. Counters with the straight right. Defensive Savant, he blocked that punch. Oh! Oh, that's a nice combination, and not just a two-piece here. Now connects with the left hand. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Casey's nose is bleeding now, so we'll see how he handles that adversity, but nothing ideal about it here in the middle of this fight. He's got the single collar tie. Oh, nice punch there in the clinch. Three minutes now to go round two. Huge block there. 
Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two, much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. Well, we may have the best cut men and women in the business, but I'm not sure they're gonna be able to do much with that cut. It continues to widen with every passing stroke. And you're fighting a great fighter. It's hard to deal with the damage of the cut while dealing with the level of the fighter in front of you. Right now, you have gotta do something different to try and change the way that this fight is playing out. an exercise in risk mitigation, right? But it would seem to me that if he really goes for it offensively, you can get him out of there. Well, he's got him hurt. He's got him hurt. He's got him hurt multiple times in one round. It looks like this fight should be over by now, but his opponent's still standing, and I think that speaks to the durability of the guy standing in front of him. Left hand connection and right. All right, so he lands again just like we saw in the last round, realizing a lot of success with his Muay Thai game tonight. You know why change it? It's working, and it's working from the very start of the fight. The moment this fight started, you saw the advantage that we predicted was there. He started to take advantage of it early, and now he's continuing to build on that. His kickboxer looks amazing in that. His body not looking too good right now. It's not quite Dominic Reyes against Jan Bohovic, but these body strikes are really starting to happen. They're starting to pay dividends. You know, he spoke to us about this earlier in the week, how he was going to eat this guy up from bottom to top. He was going to go in reverse. That is exactly what he has done. All right, 45 seconds now to go on the left. Big shot lands for both guys. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. 20 seconds left. Just a slip there. Cash money with that right hand counter. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, so the round is over, and you see the cut man not wasting any time as the fighter makes his way back to the stool. The cut man will try to shut that cut on the bridge of his nose and prevent it from becoming a factor here moving forward. All right, so a big knockdown for him courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's a replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well, but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal, and if he can land, he does have the ability to damage him. You ready to fight? Ready. Go All right, here we go with this third round of this championship fight. Slips the punch nicely there. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Great job getting that punch to the target. Push kick there to the body. Over and over and over. He's landing these nasty body kicks. Straight punch is true. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Jaquise. Man, that cut is so bad, you wonder if at some point that is going to start to affect his breathing. Oh, setting up the left hook, but out of range. Just out of range with that kick attempt. 
Well, his opponent seemed to be stunned to a significant extent, but was able to recover, and it's almost like he let him off the hook. Kind of let him off the hook. Opened up now. Nasty cut on the bridge of the nose. And that, that's the danger in the engagement there. Oh. Just misses with the left hook. Slips the shot. Well, this fight's been pretty crazy thus far. Both guys doling out a lot of damage, and neither seems too bothered by it, but clearly both parties are hurt. Both guys are hurt. Both guys are fighting beautifully. Both are showing a lot of heart right now in this fight. They're both doing amazing jobs. Let's see who gets the job done at the end of the stick. Jacasey's cut is getting worse here. Man, is that bleeding. Beautiful kick lands there. Just over two minutes now to go. And he lands that sidekick. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice good series of kicks by him. There. I mean, the kicks are coming in fun. Oh, he gets up here. on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight.